Oh, hello guys! So, I started seeing what people got interested in using a live wallpaper or animated wallpaper, whatever they call it. And it got me curious about it, so I started digging around a little bit and I found a nice little program that does that. And today, in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly that. And here we are at the GitHub page of Jeff Shi. I really hope I'm not butchering his name. And the project is named Hidamari. Or Hidamari. I'm not entirely sure, but doesn't matter. I'm gonna leave the GitHub page in the description down below as everything I use in this video. So you should not worry about that. And this is, well, very recently managed project. The last one it's like, I don't know, three weeks ago it says here. And it's a nice little program. You can read all the information you want to. And the easiest way to install is through the Flat Hub. They have the all requirement instructions here. If you don't have Flat Hub like me, well, I'm using Ubuntu, of course. So you can pretty easy set it up. I'll show you right now a little quick. Just go to the setup Flat Hub choose the distribution you are using. In my case, this is Ubuntu. And you have a couple of simple commands to enter. Let's go and do that. First, we need to install the flat hub. Yes, I agree, of course. Now it says with other Ubuntu versions, the official Flatpak PPA is the recommended way to install Flatpak. To install it, run the following in the terminal. Now depends how old your window, uh, sorry, uh, your Ubuntu distribution is. You should install the PPA instead. Now you can just if you are using the GNOME desktop and you want to integrate it into the software manager, you can install the plugin for Flatpak. Like that. Yes, I agree. And add the Flathub repository with the last command. Okay, so once again, it depends what kind of distribution you are using. In my case, I'm using the latest Ubuntu 23.10 in this video and the software center or they call it app center. It's not really <laughs> flat hub friendly, let's put it this way. So that's why I'm gonna install it through the terminal so this is all you need you can find it here the program it's just search for hidamari and it's coming up or you can just stay on the github page and down here you can find the same instructions so let's go and install that yes i agree yes of course it's gonna take a few moments to install. Okay, it's finally installed. Now at this point, 
might be a good idea to restart your machine or you can just start and search for the Hitamari let's see and of course it's not coming up so I do recommend you to restart your machine right now or just of course you can run it with the command down here it's gonna take a few moments again and it's right here now I will restart my machine anyway because I like to do that and I'll come back when it's done all right and we are back after the restart now let's try again and search for he the Mari and as you can see it's coming up it's no problem at all just open up and that's all you get now the interesting part is you need a video that you like or that you want to put for your animated wallpaper and there is a few places in the internet that you can find that of course one is pixabay Oops. just search for pixabay okay and the first one is pixabay there is another that i would recommend you that's pixel just search for Excel and again it's the first one that comes up I really like those two sites it's up to you which one you are gonna use now just pick for a wallpaper that you want to use let's go to videos of course we need a video how's that one yeah that one looks pretty good too Let's try that one. You have a nice preview here. Oh, that one looks pretty nice too. Okay, so just click download. Select the resolution for your desktop. Mine it's 1920 by 1080. Just select that and download selected size. If you want to contribute and donate, that's always a good idea. And this is another one that I really like. I'm gonna download that one too. Again, 1920 by 1080. Download selected size. It shouldn't be that slow. Okay, once the videos are downloaded, go to the download folder where they are downloaded. This is very important, just select and copy them, go to the videos and as you can see there is already a Hidamari folder here, just open it and place all the videos that you want to animate for your wallpaper right here. Okay now just open Hidamari once more. And as you can see, both of the videos you downloaded are here. Just select the one you want to use. For example, maybe this one. It's gonna take a few seconds for the program to render the videos. It's gonna use only the first 10 seconds of it. And as you can see, we have an animated wallpaper. That's awesome. I love it. All right. Isn't it beautiful? Now you may know a few other programs that do the same thing, but some of them are quite a uh, quite old now and are not anymore supported they are still working uh, on the well the latest Ubuntu but this project here it's very promising and it looks pretty new and it works as you can see pretty good so if you want to try it I'm gonna leave everything you need in the description down below 
And that's all from me. Just let me know what you think about it. And if you have some other and better projects to do the same thing, let me know in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.